<coughs> so I was here and uh, I was doing the review on the Draco and uh, I started thinking about all the uh, I I couldn't even I can't even explain where it comes from it's it's just uh, the media's it's the way that they make you think about things it, to, it's like a um, it's like indoctrination into thinking that guns are bad and you know gun owners are evil and I know that people watching this are on my side so it's kind of like preaching to the choir but uh, <clears throat> you know just get you thinking about stuff uh, when you're doing gun reviews you know and you're going through your head and uh, trying not to say oh yeah this is my new assault rifle <laughs> or uh, you know these are my extended magazines and shit like that because we've all been raised at least me, I was born in 87 and I've been raised in that culture to think you know during the gun ban and everything oh yeah these are assault weapons and uh... <clears throat> and we'll just we'll just start this is not an assault rifle uh... it is a it is a rifle caliber pistol uh... if it had a stock it still wouldn't be an assault rifle it would be a rifle a semi-automatic rifle that is magazine fed this magazine holds 30 rounds. This is not an extended magazine. This is what the designers of the weapon intended when they designed the weapon was for it to hold a 30 round magazine. So that it is not an extended magazine. It is a standard capacity magazine. Okay. And it is, it is also not a clip <laughs> because a clip is something totally different than a magazine. Okay. Anything that uh, you can think of really unless you're into World War II firearms or uh, you know anything like that then uh, most modern firearms that are semi-automatic do not use clip or uh, do not use yeah they don't use clips they use magazines this is a magazine alright this is my father's uh, Smith & Wesson it's a 40 caliber their their deal this is the magazine it came with it holds 14 rounds the manufacturer of this firearm intended it to hold 14 rounds of 40 caliber. So this is not an extended magazine. And people in, who live in states uh, like Massachusetts and California and uh, New York, if you can even get a pistol, um, they think they, they're, they're, uh, they're kept in with the 10 round magazines. And those are in fact not standard magazines. Those are reduced capacity magazines. So. This is a 20 round magazine that came with my Beretta P by 4 Storm that I just bought yesterday. It holds 20 rounds. But, see, uh, you can't see it. It states on the back of the magazine 17, since it is a 17 round magazine, but in fact holds 20 rounds of 9mm. It is an extended magazine, it is an increased capacity magazine since it is supposed to hold 17 but in fact holds 20 it is more than standard and it's all just part of I mean even my army buddies when I was in the army you know and you could see just how hard and how fast moving you know it just how how deep it had gotten you know the indoctrination of, of people just to think that you know this this name assault weapon is just so it conjures up all these evil visions of you know it just it doesn't even sound good it's a it's a media tactic to get the public um you know away from guns which you know I don't know why it's been allowed to go on this far or why it's still going on in this age where gun cells are through the roof and ammunition I mean I can't even find ammunition right now and uh you know, guns are selling like hotcakes, and I just think, you know, I, I just think that the media needs to catch up with the with the uh, pulse of America and get on that. And even Walmart's doing it nowadays. Um, if you go to their website, they they sell AR-15s now, and they don't call them AR-15 assault rifles. They call them AR-15 modern sporting rifles, which is what they are: it's modern technology used for sporting. <coughs> So you have all these things and all these, you know, I, and I hate, I'm not, you know, I'm not saying liberal or conservative or whatever, but 
just the numbers are that normally liberals, you know, you got Bloomberg up in New York and you've got, you know, California and everything, and it's always Democrats. And, you know, they, they have hoplophobia, which is the irrational fear of weapons, and um, just something in their childhood. You know, I don't know how it can happen. I don't know how you can be afraid of an inanimate object um, that can't hurt you on its own and, you know, more than likely will never hurt you in your life um, unless you invite trouble onto yourself. Yeah, and I've been shot at, and guess what? I <laughs> really am not scared of guns here in the States. Um, so that's just a little bit of knowledge and uh, just a little rant. I know you guys are on my side anyway, so I'm just kind of preaching to the choir, but it helps me feel better about the world we live in. So uh, I'll talk to you guys later.